Delirium tremens, often called the DTs, is a serious medical condition that can have devastating effects on the body and mind. It primarily affects people who are dependent on alcohol, those who have been drinking heavily for a long period. This means their bodies have become so accustomed to alcohol that they rely on it to function normally. When they suddenly stop drinking or drastically reduce their intake, their bodies go into a state of shock, unable to cope with the sudden change. This shock triggers a range of severe symptoms that can be both physically and mentally overwhelming. These symptoms include intense confusion, severe agitation, and terrifying hallucinations that can make the person feel like they are losing their grip on reality. Delirium tremens is not just a frightening experience, it is a life-threatening condition that can lead to serious complications if not treated promptly. It requires immediate medical attention and often intensive care to manage the symptoms and stabilize the patient. Imagine your brain misfiring, sending you on a terrifying, unpredictable journey where nothing makes sense. That's what it's like to experience delirium tremens, an overwhelming and disorienting ordeal. The world around you transforms, filled with things that aren't really there, making it hard to distinguish reality from hallucination. This essay will explore the strange and frightening world of delirium tremens, shedding light on its causes and effects. We will delve into the science behind it, the vivid and often terrifying hallucinations it causes, and the critical importance of understanding and treating this serious condition. Our bodies can become physically dependent on substances, including alcohol. When we consume alcohol regularly, our brains adapt to its presence. Over time, the brain needs alcohol to function normally. When we suddenly stop drinking, our brain goes into withdrawal. It's like a car running out of fuel. Without alcohol, the brain struggles to maintain balance. This imbalance triggers a cascade of physical and mental symptoms. These symptoms are collectively known as alcohol withdrawal syndrome. Delirium tremens represents the most severe form of alcohol withdrawal. Hallucinations are a hallmark of delirium tremens. These are sensory experiences that feel real, but are not. Imagine seeing things that aren't there, hearing voices whispering your name, or feeling insects crawling on your skin. These hallucinations can be terrifying, they often involve vivid, disturbing imagery. People experiencing delirium tremens might see shadows moving, objects morphing, or even menacing creatures. The hallucinations can feel incredibly real. This makes it difficult for the person experiencing them to distinguish between what's real and what's not. This confusion adds to the fear and anxiety of the condition. One of the most striking and disturbing aspects of delirium tremens is the prevalence of devil hallucinations. People often describe seeing demonic figures, shadowy beings, or grotesque creatures. These visions can be incredibly detailed and menacing. They might include horns, glowing eyes, sharp teeth, and claws. These hallucinations tap into our deepest fears and anxieties, amplifying the terror of the experience. Section 5. A Glimpse into Other Dimensions the vivid and often terrifying nature of delirium tremens hallucinations, particularly those involving devils, has led some to speculate about their origins. Could these visions be glimpses into other dimensions or realms beyond our understanding? While this idea might seem intriguing, it's important to remember that there's no scientific evidence to support it. Delirium tremens hallucinations are a product of a brain in crisis, not a window into other worlds. However, the persistence of these hallucinations, particularly those with religious or demonic themes, raises interesting questions about the nature of consciousness, perception, and the brain's role in shaping our reality. Section 6. The Brain in Crisis – Understanding the Hallucinations Hallucinations can be a terrifying experience, especially when they occur during a state of delirium tremens. The hallucinations experienced during delirium tremens are not supernatural. They are a manifestation of the brain's struggle to regain balance. They are caused by a complex interplay of factors within the brain. This intricate dance involves neurotransmitters, the brain's chemical messengers, which are thrown into disarray. Alcohol withdrawal disrupts the delicate balance of neurotransmitters, the chemical messengers that allow brain cells to communicate. When alcohol is suddenly removed, the brain's chemistry is thrown off balance. This disruption affects various brain regions, including those responsible for sensory processing, emotions, and thought patterns. The areas of the brain that interpret sensory information become hyperactive and confused, 
The result is a sensory overload, leading to the vivid and often disturbing hallucinations characteristic of delirium tremens. These hallucinations can be visual, auditory, or even tactile, making the experience even more disorienting. Imagine a symphony orchestra playing out of tune, with instruments blaring erratically. Each section of the orchestra represents a different part of the brain, and when they are not in harmony, chaos ensues. This chaotic symphony is akin to what's happening in the brain during delirium tremens. The brain's normal functions are disrupted, leading to a state of confusion and disarray. The brain, starved of the alcohol it has become dependent on, struggles to make sense of the world, leading to a breakdown in perception and reality testing. This struggle can manifest in various ways, from seeing things that aren't there to hearing sounds that don't exist. Section 7. Beyond the Veil. Exploring the Parallel World Concept. The idea of parallel worlds or alternate dimensions has captivated the human imagination for centuries. This fascination is not just a modern phenomenon, but has roots that stretch back through the annals of history. From ancient myths to modern science fiction, the concept of other realities existing alongside our own has been a source of wonder and speculation. Ancient cultures often spoke of realms inhabited by gods and spirits, while contemporary stories explore the scientific possibilities of multiverses and alternate timelines. While Delirium Tremens' hallucinations might seem to offer a glimpse into such realms, it's essential to approach these experiences with a healthy dose of skepticism. These vivid and often terrifying visions are more likely a result of the brain's complex chemistry rather than a window into another world. There's no scientific evidence to suggest that these hallucinations represent anything more than the brain's attempt to make sense of a chaotic internal state. Researchers continue to study the brain's mechanisms to understand how it constructs our perception of reality, especially under extreme conditions. However, the human fascination with parallel worlds speaks to our innate curiosity about the nature of reality, the limits of our perception, and the possibility of something existing beyond what we can see and touch. This curiosity drives both scientific inquiry and creative expression, pushing the boundaries of what we know and what we can imagine. Whether through the lens of a telescope or the pages of a novel, the exploration of parallel worlds continues to inspire and intrigue us. Hash hash, section 8. The Science of Perception. How our brains construct reality. Our brains are constantly bombarded with sensory information sights, sounds, smells, tastes, and textures. To make sense of this overwhelming input, our brains act as filters, selecting, organizing, and interpreting this information to create our perception of reality. This process is not always perfect. Sometimes our brains make mistakes, misinterpreting sensory input or filling in gaps with information that isn't really there. This is what happens during hallucinations. Hallucinations demonstrate the brain's remarkable ability to create its own reality, even when that reality is not based on external stimuli. They highlight the subjective nature of perception and the intricate interplay between our senses, brain chemistry, and conscious experience. Hash hash section 9, the importance of empathy and support. Understanding, the biological basis of delirium tremens is crucial for dispelling the stigma surrounding this condition. It's not a sign of weakness or a character flaw. It's a medical emergency that requires compassion, understanding, and appropriate medical care. Imagine being trapped in a terrifying nightmare, unable to distinguish between what's real and what's not. That's what it's like to experience delirium tremens. People going through this need our support, not our judgment. By educating ourselves about delirium tremens, we can help to create a more compassionate and understanding environment for those struggling with this condition and their loved ones. Hash hash section 10, seeking help, treatment and recovery from delirium tremens. Delirium tremens is a serious medical condition that requires immediate medical attention. If you or someone you know is experiencing symptoms of delirium tremens, it's crucial to seek help immediately. Treatment typically involves a combination of medications to manage withdrawal symptoms, reduce hallucinations, and prevent complications. The individual may also require intravenous fluids and close monitoring in a hospital setting. Recovery from delirium tremens is possible with the right medical care and support. However, it's important to remember that overcoming alcohol dependence is a long-term process that requires ongoing commitment and support. Hash hash section 11. A shared journey, supporting loved ones through delirium. 
Tremens. Supporting a loved one through delirium, Tremens can be challenging and emotionally draining. It's important to remember that their behavior is driven by a medical condition, not a personal choice. Offer reassurance, stay calm and avoid arguing with their hallucinations. Your presence and support can provide comfort and stability during this difficult time. Remember that recovery is a journey, not a destination. There will be ups and downs along the way. By offering unwavering love, support and understanding, you can play a vital role in helping your loved one overcome this challenge and reclaim their life.